Welcome back. Getting your children to make healthy eating choices is a daily chore, but there are ways you can make it fun for them, believe it or not. Making a house call tonight, Dr. Luann Labian with the Traverse Area Pediatric and Adolescent Clinic. Welcome back, Dr. Labian. Thank you. So you have this really cool red light, green light game. Tell me about this. Um, it, uh, red light, green light game, I didn't create it, but it's a great game to help kids learn how to uh, choose healthy foods. Okay. And it's really hard and you don't want to make them crazy like all of us adults about what food is this or what food is that. But it's just a fun game for the full family to pay, play so that they are choosing the right foods. So there's green light foods, which is pretty easy. Green lights are all your fruits and vegetables. Okay. Okay. Except for two. There's always telling them there's two bad guys, two bad fruits. Two bad ones. Two bad ones. One is corn, one is potato. And we talk about those in the form of potato chips and french fries. Ah, I gotcha. Okay, so there's two naughty vegetables that doesn't <laughs> always get called that. But otherwise than that, fruits and vegetables are always a healthy choice. They're always a good choice, you know, as long as they're minimally processed as far as not deep fried or something like that. You right. know, the, the, the kids can always choose those. That's always a go-to food. Go, 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 go. As go, much go, as you go. want, go-to right. food. Um, there's a yellow light food. Yellow light foods are a little harder to understand for kids because they're healthy foods for you, but yet they're not, uh, they're still portion size. So I always say slow down, think about it, eat slowly, control your portion. Mm -hmm. Mom may have to teach you which ones are yellow light foods. It's pretty much all our normal meal foods, except, you know, you only can have one hamburger, you can have two hamburgers. You only can ah. have one And most ear of the time, corn. like you're saying, they would only eat one, but they eat them so quickly, they can fit two, then their stomach hurts. That's true. But <laughs> yeah. and that, co that corn is where that fits in. Corn is gotcha. a yellow light. You have one ear of corn, not five ears of corn. Five ears so of corn. So you, you know, so all those kind of yellow light foods, you can have a yogurt, you can have bread, you can have all these things, but you can't have, you know, multiple sizes and big, you know, biggie sizes of right, things. Right, right. So, you know, all that's really important. And just slowing down, sitting down. Down, eating slowly, thinking about what you're eating, visualizing what you're eating, all that kind of yellow, kind of yellow light, slow down and mode. A lot of adults out there can, can benefit yes, as well. Yes, absolutely. All right, so red, I'm thinking stop, this is bad. Stop, stop, stop. And you know what? I never want to tell a kid any food is kind of bad. You want to tell them that uh, it's a red light food. What that really want you to think is stop, think. Stop, think. How many red light foods have I had today? So that's our junk, obviously. Potato chips, chips, right. uh, crackers, candy, you know, everybody can kind of get the gist of that. But how many have I had today? If I've had one red light food today already, because I had cookies after lunch. Oh, so then cut the rest out. So maybe I need to start thinking about how many red light foods. So usually I tell the kids one red light food a day, you don't really need any more than that. Right. Um, and a lot of kids, you'll be surprised, we start counting them up in the room and they've had five red light foods in one day. They've had a juice. Unbelievable. They come home from school, they've had something. They've had something at lunch. They've had something after, work, after school. They've had something after right. dinner. And you're like, you've had four or five red light foods a day. We gotta cut that down. Cut it down to one red light food. So right. stop and think is stop the big and thing. Think. Stop and think. That's the big thing. Well, thank you so much, Dr. Levy. And there is a lot more on this topic, and it's all going to be on the website yep. for everyone to look Absolutely. at. Absolutely. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Um, again, if you'd like more tips from Dr. Levy or the Traverse Area Pediatric and Adolescent Clinic or this fun little game, you can go to our website at northlive.com.